The trim function in Excel will remove the extra spaces in a text string, leaving a single space between the words. See this text string here. There are leading spaces before the first character, trailing spaces after the last character, and multiple spaces between the words. Now to remove the extra spaces in this text string, equal, type in trim, open parentheses, select the cell containing the text string, close parentheses, when I press the enter key, the extra spaces in this text string are removed. Let's copy this formula into the cells below. The extra spaces in the text strings of the adjacent cells are gone. Now about two practical uses of the trim function. A combination of len, substitute and trim functions can be used to get the count of words in a cell. To find the total number of words in this cell, in the formula bar, equal len function, open parentheses, trim function, open parentheses, select the cell containing the text string, close parentheses, again close parentheses, minus len function, open parentheses, substitute function, select the cell containing the text string, comma, double quotes space double quotes, comma, double quotes double quotes, close parentheses, once again close parentheses, plus 1, when I press the enter key, formula return 5, the count of words in the adjacent cell. Let's add few more words here. See the formula result updated. Let's copy this formula into the cells below. And we have the count of words in adjacent cells. Trim function can also be used to extract the last word in a cell. In the formula bar, equal, trim function, open parentheses, write function, open parentheses, substitute function, select the cell containing the text string, comma, double quote space double quotes, comma, repeat function, open parentheses, double quote space double quotes, comma, 100, close parentheses, Again, close parentheses, comma, 100, close parentheses, once again, close parentheses. When I press the enter key, here we have the last word in this cell. Again, let's copy this formula into the cells below.